Hey everybody, welcome back, Phoenix here. Today I'm going to show you, as you know, the mystical art of recording your screen on iOS. I am currently running iOS 9.3.5, but I'm sure it works on iOS 10 and above and below. Go yeah, iOS 9.3.5. The link will be up here and in the description. So I'm, it's going to take you to this website, FTIS ftios.net slash install and you type that in you don't need the HTTP it'll just put it in automatically um, so it'll take you to this page here you just want to click um, see it's just got this kind of app here you just want to click English and this will be the app that will get you to Airshell in the correct version which is the one you want because basically everywhere else will take you to Airshell like version if it's above version 0.6.1 you can only broadcast and it sucks and everybody hates it yeah so it will redirect you to the settings page which should do and just click install and do your passcode so you put that in and that will just install click install install everything's installed uh, just load the installing profile and profile install done Right, so now you'll see you have this nice little app with a cool design called FTOS. Um, so just open up this app. Open the app and it all should look like this. Just click FTOS store or FT store. Now you you can this is a very useful app store like Tutu Helper. Um, it's good both good app stores. Um, like I'll do another separate video on Tutu Helper. Um, so these um, both get you like free apps and stuff like that. You want to go onto Utilities for iPhone, and you'll see this little key here. And if you scroll down, you see um, there you go. There's Airshell, and you want to make sure that that is version 0.6.1. That is an important part to make sure that it will record your screen. There you go. See that? So you just want to click on it, or tap on it, and it'll pop up this little page. What could be clearer? Click install. There we go. Um, so it'll just pop up with this. Of course, you're going to click install. We're having lots of installing in this video. Lots of clicking install. All right, so that will do that, and you just go head home. All right, so just head home, and you'll see the little air shell icon loading up. Um, also don't hate me if it's pronounced show or shoe or something, I don't know. Here, we'll let the cat hold it up while it wait, while we wait. And there you go. As you can see, we have installed Airshell. Let's just pop the camera back up. There we go. Um, so I think... Alright, so you should be able to open it. Yeah, just click agree. And there you go, you should have the option to broadcast and record. Uh, yeah, you get some ads pop up. And there should not be a sign-in page if the, um, because on any of the other versions you get sign-in page and that means it's the wrong version. If you click info button, you'll see that we have version 0.6.1. That is the correct version that we need to recording and I have no idea why they ruined Airshell by making it so you can only broadcast. Right. So, if you want to record your screen, which I would definitely want to do, uh, you can give your video a name, and I'll just call it Tutorial. Uh, you can choose your orientation, I'll go with Portrait, yeah. Uh, I'll keep it 720p, and then once you click Net Next Step, you'll see this little thing shown there, and it shows you what to do. Just swipe up, um, click Airplay, you'll see the name of it, click Mirroring. And there you go. As you see, it will load and it'll load, and there you go. You're now recording your screen. So it's now everything that's on my screen is being recorded right now. You can do it if you want. You know, you can like record a game. Um, also, if you're recording games, make sure you have the correct uh, orientation for it. Right, so you see, I could might want to like record a epic true skate video um, that sucked you know do some play your games and unlike some other screen recorders which aren't as good you can record for as long as you want um, the only thing you'll notice with screen recorders though they may make your games lag a little bit 
um, the more lag, the higher the resolution, or the other way around, you know, the higher the resolution, the more it will lag the game. So as you can see, it's a little more choppy, but you can hardly tell. Um, because it's, it's a, just a very balanced screen recorder. So, uh, there you go. That is how you record your screen with Airshell. And if I, you can just tap that, go back in, click stop. And it will, you make sure to do this as well. Um, once you finish your recording, go in here, tap that, and click save to camera roll. Uh, access your photos, let it do that so it can save to the camera roll. So now, you can go home. Go to your photos. And... There you go, there's the video. Load and there you go. You're now recording your screen. So, so now everything that's on my screen is being recorded right now. Right, so there you go everybody. That is how you get um, Airshell, which is the good screen recorder for iOS. Um, there are other methods, I think, but this is the best, best method to get the version that you will want. 0.6.1 the best version you probably if you are into this stuff you've probably seen other people ranting about 0.7.1 like only letting you broadcast and stuff well i hope this video was helpful to you please leave a like if you enjoyed it subscribe if you're new and yeah see you in the next video thanks for watching